sweeties and welcome back to my channel my name is michelle and i am a mommy of six kiddos all right and i have my boyfriend can't forget the boyfriend come on now <laughs> no we are not married but anyways and if you're new to my channel please subscribe to my channel i would love to have you here it will mean the world to me um just because i get to share my 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 experiences with you Alright, so now I'm going to be making an update video on what's been going on with my life. It seems like this is all I do, just make update videos, right? But it will change. I promise you guys it will change. So, let's start back to like, I think I made, the last video I made, like a vlogging video was like New Year's or something like that. Well, the thing now here is that my baby has been getting sick ever since like november he's been getting pink eye ear infection um strep throat and all these kind of things the last thing that he got was a really horrible rash which i took him to the doctor and she told me it was like an allergic reaction to something that nothing to worry about it was just really horrible it looked like hives so i said okay so i came home and within like an hour those rashes turned black so I freaked out I called the doctor and she said you know what Michelle you're gonna have to go to the hospital so I said okay so I went to the hospital and they checked him and everything and like every doctor was coming in because this this was like something so rare that you know they had not seen like I literally got into the hospital and I told them what was going on and they literally took me in like right away and that scared the pickles out of me like I was super super scared I started crying because I'm like, the second they just took me inside, I was like, this is not good. So I, I freaked out and I started crying. And I was just like, please, you know, just let me know what's going on with him. He's been sick on and off. Like, he does not get better. It's not even on and off. It's like, he gets, he gets sick and then he's finally sort of closing that cycle. And then he gets sick again with something different. So I was crying, the nurse told me not to worry, not to panic, the doctors are coming, they're going to check him and blah blah blah. So the thing is that he was also having fevers. The highest he was he got that same day was 103 point something. It was just so horrible. So now they gave me the paperwork on what he got and I lost the paperwork. I think I threw it out, I'm not going to lie. But um, he got something called multiform, something it starts with an E and then multiform. And it, it's, uh, I don't know, it's like, if you Google it, it just is the craziest things. The doctor said, don't Google it. Please don't go home and Google this. So he did send me back home that same day, but I had to come back the next day so they can do um, urine um, tests on him. So I did go back the next day and they did the urine test and everything seemed fine. And also the baby was the baby did not have that rash anymore so i was like oh my god finally i think this is ending so he told me not to worry you know everything he said that everything is fine he's like it might get worse but don't worry he'll be fine in case that he can't breathe he can that he's like literally like spitting out like a lot of saliva like he's drooling a lot <laughs> bring him in into the doctor if he's having fevers that are not going down with tylenol or motrin bring him down to the hospital so Thank God, none of that has happened, and right now, crossing my fingers, knock on wood, he's doing much better. He does have a little bit of cough, and, and that's it, and I just hope it doesn't progress from there at all. Now, when that was all going on, all my kids got sick. The day I took him to the to see the rash, like to the, to the doc, for the doctor to see the rash, I took in my other children because they were also coughing, they were complaining about throat pain, one of them had a fever, so it was like a whole disaster. Like my whole household got sick. So all my kids had strep throat. So except for Michelle. And um yeah, they were just here, they were stuck at home for a few days, and then um and then my boyfriend <laughs> He's like, I feel sick. Ugh, I think I just caught on to whatever the kids are having. My throat hurts. And my boyfriend, he got sick. And he just literally, just yesterday, he feels so much better. Just yesterday. I'm doing this video January. Sorry, I'm still living in January. February 6th. And he just came to me. He's like, Michelle, I feel much better. And he got sick the next day. Or I don't know. I think maybe the same day. 
I was super sick and it felt horrible like I felt so weak and I was just laying down all day all day like I had my oldest take care of like thankfully he stayed home with me because he was he he was still feeling sick so he did not go back to school that was a Monday and he stayed home with me and he helped me with the baby and take care of like the baby while he, I was sleeping because I was super weak like I literally was driving and I felt so dizzy and I felt like I was gonna just run someone over or run someone over or just crash into something and I was like, oh my god, I really just need to get home now. Because I was, you know, dropping off kids, picking up kids, and all of that. But thank the Lord. Thank the Lord that they... You know what also I think happened is that I took a NyQuil in the day. So I think that's what happened. That's why I was feeling like that. And I slept. Like, literally, I slept the whole day. I woke up to feed my kids, make food, and that's it. Put them to bed, went back to sleep. And, yeah. But anyways that's been going on so i haven't been able to upload videos to make videos or anything upload videos because of my kids that they have been sick especially my baby like my baby has been sick a lot and you know obviously i will love and i prefer and i have to take care of my baby first so that's what i have been doing right now um it is two o'clock in the afternoon 2.30, I have 30 more minutes to make this video, hopefully it's not that long, um, you know, to take, what am I saying, I forgot, Woo! I just like that right now, anyways, so, yeah, my baby's here, you know, the kids are in school, so in 30 minutes I'm gonna be leaving to pick up my kids, and that's what happened, you guys, that's what's been keeping me off from YouTube, um, it's just been so many things, like, one after the other. Like, um, having my sixth child has been really hard. Like, I was doing videos, like, constantly before I had him. But then once I had him, everything got so hard. And then, like, one thing after another, one thing after another. And it's like, oh, my God. It's like, maybe YouTube isn't meant for me. You know? So, anyways. So, now, another thing. Let's move on to the next thing. Um, I got an email saying that YouTube is changing the rules the the game the whatever you want to call it and you know it says that you have to have a thousand subscribers in order to monetize your videos and four thousand views i don't have that <laughs> i've been in youtube for two years and unfortunately i think i only have 190 last time i checked and i don't know how in the world i'm gonna get a thousand subscribers or four thousand hours of view of views I don't know so I don't know how I'm going to do that in the beginning it did bum me out I felt bad and everything because I'm like great um, I'm not gonna be able to monetize my videos anymore but then I was like wait a minute why am I so bummed out if I'm not even getting paid for this um <laughs> so it's like if I worried if I was gonna get paid or not but anyways um I'm gonna work hard on my YouTube hopefully I reach that goal soon and then I can monetize my video because I'm pretty sure that when they do that, I don't think you will be able to do certain things with your videos. So, crossing fingers that, you know, I can still do whatever I'm doing on my videos right now. So then, also, um, I have been doing videos and I need to upload those. Um, there's one where I'm cleaning and I talk about my goals. But I think that I'm not going to put that on because it's just like all over the place. So, I just wanted to talk to... I just wanted to talk about it here right now we have me and my boyfriend have 2018 goals I'm pretty sure a lot of us does a lot of us do so our main goal our main main goal is to not spend money which we're failing already we are I'm not gonna lie and um but that's like just our main goal. We want to save up money as much as we can. Like, you know, put um, the, the unnecessary things to the end. Or like like an, un like an example would be like uh, my son's birthday is coming up. My biggest son. He's going to be 13. And yeah, you know teens they ask for big things like they want money or whatever but I already spoke to my son I spoke to all my kids about it like my um birthday 
don't expect big things, you know. We're just gonna maybe say happy birthday to you, give you a little present, and that's it. Whatever we can afford in our budget, our 2018 budget. So, luckily, they do understand, I think, I hope. And, yeah, so my son's birthday is coming up, and I don't think I'm gonna be giving him something big or humongous. Like, no, 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 it's not gonna happen. Um, but yeah, that's our main goal is to save money as much as we can because we obviously do want to get out of where we are living. This place where we are living is very small. My boys share a room. My girls share the room. I had a bedroom. I no longer had a bedroom. I no longer have a bedroom. I mean, this is where I am. This is my bedroom. I mean, it is my bedroom, but my baby sleeps in here. I only have his crib in here. I got rid of my bed. Um... One night I was sleeping, I was getting bites and everything, so I'm like, please dear God, don't tell me that's bed bugs. Please dear God. And unfortunately, finally, after like three months of like getting bites all over me, I discovered that I had bed bugs. So I grabbed those things and I just, I threw everything out. I threw my whole bed out. I threw the metal thingy out. I threw everything out. I'm like, I'm not keeping you. I don't want to deal with it. I don't want to go with the cleaning process of this, this and that. So I just killed it. I just killed it. I just threw it out. And I purchased myself a steamer. Uh, I guess a good steamer that you can actually use to steam. And supposedly, you know, the, the heat kills the bed bugs and blah, blah, blah. So that's what I have done just yesterday. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> because I just got it yesterday. So, <laughs> yeah. That's what's going on too. And sorry for this video to be all over the place. But I just wanted to to get this out and let you guys know everything and let me see let me think of anything else mm. well that's just basically it um nothing too crazy and i'm sorry for my hair if it looks a mess i took a shower and i don't have time to do my hair so i'm just wait because i like to let it like um air dry so i'm just waiting for that to happen and then i'll brush it and do something which I'm not gonna do anything i'm just gonna probably tie it up into a ponytail and that's it so you guys if there's anything i missed in this video i'll put it out there in another video i will continue to do vlogs i don't plan on doing daily vlogging like in the beginning because um i don't always have the time to sit down and edit but i do plan on doing vlogging i do plan on doing my videos my cleaning videos uh grocery haul videos i I'm gonna actually record a a clothing haul video, what I bought, and yeah, those typically are, and I'm gonna have some other exciting videos too that I'm planning on that I'm like, just have them in my head, but I, I just haven't had the time. I was actually gonna record them on Saturday, but I get shy around my boyfriend, so he was here, and I was like, why didn't you go to work? Hello, go to work, I need videos to do, I need, I need to make my videos, but he stayed home for three days. that will be all my loves um please 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 if you're new to my channel please subscribe to my channel i would love to have you here if you guys like this video give it a big a big 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 thumbs up and leave me a comment of what you guys would like to see next or just leave me a beautiful comment a mean comment i don't care um but just remember to stay happy strong and positive to follow your dreams and accomplish them and to never give up Alright you guys, I will see you on my next video.